This custom room brings you a lot of customizations, a lot of features and in this video we are going to talk about 10 plus amazing features which you have installed. If you have installed Rising OS, you might get all these features and you have to explore all of them on your device. Let's find out quickly which are the features which you have and those are just so cool features in Rising OS in case you are using that. First one is lock screen clocks. If you are using Rising OS latest version, it brings you the styles in a lot of of basically it brings you the styles a lot of lock screen clock styles including the fonts yes that's something really amazing in some of the custom rooms you already have the option to customize the lock screen clocks but not the fonts but in this case you also have the option to customize the fonts too second one is lock screen widgets we are talking about lock screen it also brings you widgets on lock screen and that is one of the main highlights of using rising os which brings you the option for big widgets and mini widgets which simply gives you the vibes of nothing os and yes it looks so good you can make it look like nothing OS with the help of some customizations with the help of some tweaks that looks so good after applying all of these things as you can see this is how my lock screen is looking like two big widgets and four mini widgets Another thing is we have the option for user switcher in the lock screen. So for example, if you are using multi-user on your device on, on this in this custom room, you can switch between them very easily directly from the lock screen and that option is available in the lock, lock screen settings. You just have to enable it and that is it. Another one is boot animation styles. This is one of my favorite features personally. Like you can customize or you can switch between these kind of boot animations. It brings you some boot animations pre-installed, but you can also choose your custom boot animation. You just need boot animation.zip file if you have any, and you can choose that to make it as a boot animation of your device. Another thing is the settings UI customization. In settings UI, you have the option to switch between material UI style, colorful and oxygen OS legacy and of course the default one already and some options in the settings as you can see, enabling the about phone information directly here, some widgets here, these things look so good. If you love to do customizations on a device, if you love to have some interesting UI changes on a device, Rising OS is always one of the best options for you. Another thing which is actually so, so, so good and quite underrated and that is status bar padding options. Sometimes status bar icons, you just not, you should actually need them at the this stage or basically at this place. It's just slightly here and there on the status bar, left side, right side. You can customize these things and the option is available in the status bar padding options. Another feature which you have here is the cache cleaner. It was introduced with the version 5.2 as far as I know. Enable the cache cleaner service to automatically clear app cache. I'm not exactly sure how the feature actually works, but it's aware here, so just wanted to let you know. Another thing is it's related to gestures now. In the terms of gestures, we have a lot of options available for you. It brings you some shake gesture options where you have the option to choose a certain number of actions. You also have the option for three finger swipe gestures. You also have the option for three finger holding the gestures. I mean, these are some so good options. Three finger long press, three finger swipe. You can customize, you can enable any of these options and there are many actions available for you to customize and enable. Another thing is it's related to security option, basically bypassing the security options. In other words, you have the option to hide the developer status, which is so useful. You also have the option for hiding the screen capture status and the no storage restrict option. Quite common features and yes, definitely these are present in Rising OS 2. This is actually one of the, the one of the custom rooms which brings you almost every useful thing you need in your device. We have some spoofing options present already which brings you the option or which brings you the ability to spoof the Google apps. You also have the option to choose a custom play integrity fix, which is so useful. You can customize, you can choose custom PIF play integrity fix file to fix the play integrity anytime, anywhere. We also have the option for dynamic island notification. Not so sure how, I mean, how many of you actually love this thing. Personally speaking, I don't use it much, but it's available. So just wanted to let you know in case you want to explore this thing on a device. Last but not the least, we also have the option related to sound engine. And that seems quite amazing and interesting one. Not many custom rooms give you this one, but yes, in case you are using this, you can explore this thing too. This was a quick video regarding this one. So thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Take care.